So, Gaffer, another game tomorrow um, in front of the BT cameras and a later kickoff. But what are your thoughts ahead of the game? Yeah, really looking forward to uh, the game. Obviously, the cameras are down. It's a, a home fixture. And this is one that we're, we're always really motivated at, at home because we know we want to really put on a show for our fans. And uh, obviously, it should be a big mark of respect for our, for our Queen as well. So, um, you know, it should be a, hopefully a great spectacle um, we're looking to put on. And uh, I know the club will, will remember the Queen really well as well. So, uh, you know, hopefully we'll give a good account of our club. It's obviously going to be a busy game, a busy day, like you say, but obviously the, it's all about the 90 minutes in terms of football, isn't it? So, so what are your thoughts ahead of Halifax coming down? Yeah, another, another stern test and you know, it, it's always going to be, and we, we say this every week, this, this league throws up lots of different challenges. They've just uh, you know, put a couple of wins on the board. Um, obviously flew really high last season, so we know the quality that they possess and it's another real strong National League outfit. So as always, we're going to have to be at our very best, um, you know, prepared the best we can um, after obviously what was quite a long trip to, to Notts County where there's plenty of positives in the game, um, lots of areas for improvement and learning from as well. But, you know, we're not, we're not far away. Um, I think there was uh, lots of good bits to celebrate in that game, apart from we probably didn't... Um, Find, find the net when we did have good spells in the game or good chances in the game uh, against a, an excellent Notts County side, I must add. I mean, um, you know, they, they really did test us um, and we had to be disciplined and not open too much space against them. And I think we certainly did that, but probably their quality just shone through in the end where we weren't able to, to punish them when we, when we had our chances. So, um, you know, we, we feel that we're not, we're not too far away, but we've got to continue to really believe in ourselves. We've really got to keep being brutal with ourselves, keep trying to refine the way uh, we play. We're, we're learning more about ourselves all the time and, and the team that we want to be. And, uh, you know, we're starting to gel those, those partnerships, hopefully. Um, we've been buoyed by a couple of signings now. Um, you know, we obviously took OD and uh, Faisal from QPR uh, not too long ago. And uh, Tom Whelan's joined us today as well. So I think it's um, no secret that obviously Joe Parts and Josh McCoy had missing that, that experience. Um, you know, was, was was a bad miss for us. I think Tom Whelan comes in with, with a wealth of experience. He knows this league very well. He's had, you know, played at some big clubs in this league. So um, I think he'll certainly bring that, that experience that we're probably missing, but also the, the, the quality on the board as well. So um, that, you know, I feel that's a real good positive step for us. Um, and and we're very much looking forward, forward to the game now. Faisal and Odie obviously came off, off the bench against Notts quite late on, but Tom's come in as well. Can we expect to see a few of them in the lineup? Can you give us any hints ahead of that? Yeah, well, they both joined very, uh, like the QPR lads, they've obviously joined very quickly. We had a couple of training sessions. Um, Tom's come in today, so um, they're definitely in contention, that is for sure. But, um, you know, they, they need to probably just learn how we, how we play and what we want. So whether t tomorrow comes too early to start or whether they come on, like we've certainly got that option available now, which is, which is great for me. So we've got, we've got back some competition for places now, which is always good. And um, yeah, we'll, we'll be putting our best foot forward. Last time out at the Ebb, obviously we, we beat Barnet and it was a brilliant, brilliant atmosphere, brilliant end to the game. Um, and it's all about recreating that, isn't it? Yeah, absolutely. We've got to create that, that tempo, that energy on the pitch. And, uh, you know, hopefully, you know, and we know that our fans will match that. They just need to see that energy, that intent, that attitude, and we're certainly looking looking to do that. We know we're up against stern opposition, but it's, it's a challenge we're we're looking to meet head on. Click here for the latest match highlights, and click here to subscribe. Are you in with a shot? Look below for more information.